Hello guys, who here, back with another video. This time around we are, as the title says, gonna go on a journey. And the journey is to, well, hit the buttons on my keyboard and then go to the marketplace and spend a million flux. Actually twice, actually gonna do that. So the title says just a million, but it's gonna be a million times two because I'm gonna do it on two different accounts. Uh, I have an alt account and then I have like two random accounts uh, and that random account was kind of one i was just playing a little bit on to show people how you're going to start and stuff like that I, that video is actually on the channel called uh, explain everything it's kind of like a four hour video where i just kind of play the first four hours of uh, you know a new account and then people can kind of play along that was kind of the idea with it but the point is that that account, uh, of course, also can gain a lot of mastery, which that's what the title says. We are going to buy items on the marketplace that give mastery. And then we're going to see how much can we actually get from the marketplace, how much mastery can we get from the marketplace if we had a million flux. So it's not totally like a guide. It's more of a like, is it worth like spending a million flux on, you know, the marketplace? versus using that to buy like not buy real power or something like that, but uh, you know boost your character in different ways because mastery do give you power but it doesn't give you like a lot of power it's kind of just uh, the spoiler is already here it's not going to be worth it but uh, you can kind of follow along and kind of just see what if somebody spent a million flux on the marketplace uh, so you could also i could also titled the video uh, spending a million flux on the video so you don't have to basically or whatever uh, so that could be at the title as well so but of course this is the main account uh, I will jump over to the other two accounts as well then I'll do a little intro thingy and then uh, you know I'll buy all the stuff and then we'll can see how much I could get from that a million flux so the other one I would say of course this account my main account is end game the other one I would say is like mid game and the other one is definitely early game so uh on the marketplace here i could show you guys as well if we do put up the marketplace right here you can see i can go ahead and if you use a little uh, semicolon right here and hide the stuff uh, as here and you just set a head search you are going to get most of the stuff that you are missing it's not going to be everything there is going to be you do have to go into some of these and then check it uh, for example if i do go like of course hit that button and hit this ally for example it is not going to show you up all the results that i'm missing because if i do this for example you can see that then some stuffs do show up it's because there's so much stuff in the pool of things that it can't show it it's not super optimized but with the little semicolon here you can see most of it you're not going to see everything but you can see then stuff here is going to start costing me a million flux if i go back here and see this is starting at 800 now 800,000 is what this is going to be so if i was going to gain any mastery from the marketplace on the main account uh, then you know, i'm up here on the 800,000 and it can also seem like not a lot but it totally it really uh, really ramps up in a uh, cost as well and i can of course show if you don't know i am on 728 trove mastery and total 828 mastery so there's a bunch of mastery i still can get from this but i, I would be really really quickly poor if i uh, were to start just hitting the uh, known uh, marketplace button right here but that was the uh, i guess the intro now we can jump to the mid tier all right so as i said we are going to be on the mid tier here on the mid tier account uh, this one I made a while back, of course, way back when uh, I first started playing Trove and, you know, all the accounts were kind of a thing. It's not really what it is anymore, but, you know, I still have this account just having a little bit of fun doing. You can see the quest for, you know, what we got going on right now, the Spring Fling, right? I'm doing that two times just because I love it that much. No, it's just a fun little quest, so that's why I'm doing it. Uh, anyways, uh, we're going to see right here because that's much more important what we are around, what the mastery is around. So this could be way higher from the time that I've actually been playing because I don't really do these super much the events on this one. Usually if it's just an easy event where you just have to do a bunch of stuff, I sometimes do it. It's also depending on what I got going on, you know, in my real life or in my gaming life. Uh, right now I'm playing a lot of Diablo, for example, right? So not doing much right here because I'll see why I'm stuck on nine. <laughs> I'm really stuck. I just have to do some more one star dungeons. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not doing it right now because I got other stuff going on. But the point is, um, this is, I would say, is sort of mid-tier. I probably would 
maybe go into around here as well. That could also be a good time to go in here because I never spend any flux on this account. Very, very little. It, only if I have to like power myself up, of course, I have spent some flux and stuff. But it mostly is just for, uh, you know, boosting the other characters as what it was before, you know, I was playing that character. And then when I basically done everything I needed to do on the main account back in the day, uh, I basically switched this one and then I did everything I could do because there was a lot less tomes and stuff like that in the game, a lot less content to do as well. But this is where the mastery is at now. So let's open up the marketplace and start buying some stuff. You can see I'm only on half million. I do have a million in right here, but I'll show you guys right here what it's kind of looking like. So you can see there's also recipes in here that we are going to uh, also buy and then uh, get ourselves the mastery. So I'm not gonna bore you with me, me hitting all these, buying all these things. I am going to uh, you not know, buy the uh, you know certificate, the titles basically, uh, because the titles do not give any mastery. So it's gonna be everything that is going to give, of course, a mastery. You can see there's a bunch of stuff that I'm going to do as well. So I'm gonna buy these things and then I'm gonna write down what they gave me a mastery. And then when I come back, uh, when you're gonna see this, of course, it's gonna be a second for you guys. Uh, you're gonna see how much I actually accumulated uh, of mastery and how much a uh, 1 million flux took, uh, or how much I gained mastery gained from 1 million uh, flux uh, spent on this one. So with that said, uh, I'm going to start uh, buying some stuff of these and I'll see you guys when I have spent a million flux. All right, that was just a second for you guys. I, I, I think it was like uh, 20 minutes or so for me or whatever it was, but maybe even a half an hour, I don't know. But we uh, did do it all and I can show you guys right over here. I did uh, get up and uh, mastery a little bit. Of course you get more because it's gonna require more and more mastery points uh, the further you go, of course, for every level. So it's gonna have a more impact when you are further uh, down as well. I did do a little bit of thing here. You can see I have a lot of recipes still. It was kind of, taking too long with the recipes i feel like so there is a bunch of recipes in here you really don't get a lot for master mastery from these so i kind of went in first into the allies and mounts and stuff like that but i kind of just decided to just go with it and just go through the pages and whenever i saw something then i would be you know around that as well so i and i know it was only 990,000 and stuff like that so it's i just rounded up to a million and also spend you can see i spent a little bit more than like the what i you know deconstructed and stuff like that so it's around a million, I guess, in, in total. But the point is that I kind of skipped all the, you can see the sell recipes, but these all like is two mastery points and sure 11,000 is not much for two mastery points. But then on the other hand, you know, there's just a lot of stuff. And again, all the titles don't give any mastery and stuff. I guess they're just gonna be there in forever until you learn them, because this is basically hiding everything you collected. And unfortunately there's not a, like a, recipe whatever you call it, like a history that's what i mean there's no history of what you basically bought so i can't tell you how much i bought and stuff like that but what i can tell you is how much mastery i gained from this and i was kind of surprised i actually gained this much for one million on this account uh, uh, very much because i'm thinking we're gonna get much more on the other account we're gonna get to that's at least my expectations but i'm very surprised that we got 583 mastery points out of it that's also on the screen right now but yeah 583 points we did so there's not levels of course that would be insane but that's points so as you can see right here i'm kind of uh, at the point where it's kind of gonna cost me like around 165 per level so approximately five levels i got out of it maybe like more more accurate four levels basically but i did get a, you know, a few levels out of that so that was not a lot of gain for 1 million flux. And in this economy, maybe a million flux is not that much, but as a starting player, it's, you know, more interesting to get this. Of course, people that are, you know, in game, they know what it all costs, but it could be nice for people that are, you know, starting out in the game, kind of knowing what it's all about. But that's, again, this is the mid tier uh, account. So we're gonna switch it up now to the, new account or a newer account i guess it's not really new i've had it for a long time but it's in in the power it has that's basic where it's new so we're going to jump on to the a newer account all right guys now we are on the starter account if you can say like i think that maybe is the more of a 
proper noun for this one. Uh, also, something I did forget to talk about or said before, I can show it right now, is that um, I don't take the items if they're like stacked, like you can see all these. I try to find ones that ha only have one. So it kind of makes a little bit more sense, I think, because like, uh, you know, um, if I if I take this, like this costs two million, how am I going to use all these styles? So uh, I'll, I'll take kind of one uh, piece of him. So that, of course, sometimes makes it a little bit more expensive uh, instead of buying all these. So, yeah, I'm uh, not really going to buy uh, like, you know, 134 of these. Uh, that's also going to cost all that. Then I have to sell it again. So I do really have to kind of so uh, you could go ahead and do so and then sell the rest of them if you want to do so. But uh, yeah, I'm not going to go ahead and uh, do that. But for this account here, as you can see right here, uh, we are level 28 uh, mastery points, uh, mastery levels, that's rank, <laughs> of course. We are still on the 100 mastery points per level, so whenever we've got 100, we are going to stack up on here, so you can see that as well. So I will see this kind of a, a, you know, a starter account, uh, definitely take uh, you know uh, everything in account for uh, that. So this was, again, I played like around five, uh, four or five hours on this one, and then put it all on YouTube, so you people can start doing the same thing as well and we got around level 18 or whatever uh, on this and then I just have this account and kind of use it for different purposes but now it's a good purpose for this video so uh, again like we did for the other I am just going to you know collect the, the mastery that I can for the million flux that I have and then of course uh, we are going to see how much mastery we can collect from the master you know the marketplace uh, for, for a million flux uh, on this account as well. So I'll be right back. Uh, see you guys in one second. It's probably going to be a lot longer for me, but I'll see you guys in one second. All right, guys, that was it. If you can say it like that. Wow, that took a while to uh, get there, but we got there in the end. It took a while. You have spent a million flux, as you can see right here. When I do go into here, you can see some if it is uh, gone. Um, so there is a few items I actually was very surprised that I kind of forgot all about. But if you actually go down here, if you haven't got them already, if you go down under mounts, you can see now my amounts is about 70,000. So I could get some of these as well. But I was very surprised that, um, well, I wasn't surprised. I kind of knew it, but I forgot all about it. And it's called, of course, the mounts from the Trova Wonders. There is some that are like super common, but actually gives like 100 mastery points per level it's at, oh, well per item which is super super insane usually amounts are from like the uh, i would say quote unquote the bad mounts or like 50 mastery points that's like the lowest they get and then 100 mastery is like the good mounts that are like crazy good and all of these actually gave that so it just like i boosted completely through the roof on this one here so just keep that in mind if you haven't already got them go under mounts go under do do the thing that's right over here hide and collecting and sort by items and see if you actually have these mounts if you don't go ahead and get these if you have opened a bunch of troll wonders to get a ganda you probably already have all of them usually that's also why they're very priced very very low but it's very very cheap and very very nice uh, so i was very very surprised upon that and also something i was kind of also forgot all about is of course flask you can see flask here now they're getting a little bit pricey up here but these actually give 25 mastery points per flask and there are a lot of cheap ones out there because you also get these from troll wonders and stuff and they you just get a bunch of them and you yeah you don't need that many <laughs> of course need only one so you can see that's why there's so many for sale uh, i should probably have bought some of these actually now that i think about it that might have been better um some of this there's just a bunch of stuff in here there's also a pair of wings that are super cheap uh also from the troll wonders so everything is from the troll wonders is just like so cheap because everybody has it by now and you get so much of it so it's, it's super super easy uh, mastery points but just a little just just a little bit of a heads up on all that but of course what you're wondering if how many mastery points did we get for a million flux on the starter accounts and here it is 2047 mastery points 2000 mastery points and as you said as i said before we do get 100 we only need 100 mastery points per level so i got 20 levels guys 20 levels from this you we started around 21 i think or something like that i can't remember it says so and you saw that from the start of the video i can't remember now but we should have gotten like 20 levels at least but we are now on 48 so you can do quick math uh you know <laughs> what we got but we got a bunch of amazing stuff out of it of course you all do that in the beginning so 
but 2000 i was very surprised that we hit 2000 i was thinking maybe like 1500 max would be that but I don't know i just totally forgot about the troll wonders items and of course i don't have it on this account i had it on the other one uh because again they were so cheap and usually people just like throw them in a community chest and like they have like a billion of them and and just put them in there because you'd get them like pretty often and you don't need them for anything and they don't sell for anything something else i actually do think is pretty insane is uh if i do go under here and press fortress you can see fortress mount this is a complete mount guys this is a complete mount for only 240,000 flux this is uh 250 mastery points this is a complete dragon for for this one and there's two dragons uh i think if i can remember how to spell it yeah you can see this is the auburn that's the, the other mount you get in the troll wonders so these are like the big items of except for the ganda of course the ganda being the biggest but this is like the second tier and these usually was they started when i was playing they were like expensive and then point point when i was looking them up again after i got them like way back uh that they're, they're super uncommon they were like a million flux each and i was like wow that's insane like it's a million flux each and now they're down to this and there's been so for a while like this is 250 mastery points as well so for like half a million flux you get 500 mastery points it's absolutely insane and also of course it's a complete dragon so you don't need coins or anything like that you just learn it and then you basically just use it as well so that's pretty insane as well so maybe actually you know on the other account uh, i should have bought them or maybe i should have just bought them here uh, maybe the other account would have been better uh, for this one so there is it's not really a guide this one i hope i made that clear but if i didn't i'm sorry but yeah it was just an insight to how much you are actually going to get for your million flux on different ranges on a, like a starter account on a mid tier uh, and also kind of on an in-game one as well but it gets pretty pricey as well but this is actually just insane for for what it is basically and they will only drop in price uh, over time of course but maybe they won't like but when everybody has it and you know more and more flux get added by people buy more and more troll wonders to try to chase that ganda which of course then again it gives a lot more than that so anyways thank you guys so much for watching this video i really hope you guys enjoyed it somewhere on the screen there should be a video you can click you should probably check it out because troll thinks that you might really like it and i'm pretty sure it's pretty awesome as well it could be in one of my videos then it's even awesomer but thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye